my name is Bam, and this is my story. It was just a typical Friday night for me. Tamang chill lang sa Cubao after shift with friends, and as usual, lasing na naman po tayo. After the said event, I started preparing to go home, and since I'm a little bit tipsy, I asked Timmy if he can send me home. He replied, Kaya mo na yan. Madaming tax dyan sa tabi. I was wondering tuloy if these friends really care for me. While I was waiting for a cab around Scout Rallyos, Justin texted me, Mag-ingat ka ha, text ka agad pag uwi. And sabi ko, thanks for the night baby. Then shortly, I found a cab. As usual, sa likod upo ang bading para makatulog. I usually text my friends the details about the plate number of the cab so just in case may mangyari alam nila kung sino ang hahanapin While texting, kuya driver talked to me Sir, saan po kayo? Sa Maynabaliches lang po In fairness ha, ang pogi ni kuya mukhang may booking ang bakla While passing a street in Kamuning kuya suddenly stopped talking Then I asked Kuya, antok ka na? Okay lang po ako sir, sabi niya. After a few minutes on the road, tingin siya ng tingin sa rear view mirror niya. Kinikilig ako kasi baka bet niya ako. While we are around C5 in Mindanao Avenue, nagsalita ulit siya like a normal convo. So okay, then we reach Del Mundo Street in Carino Highway. Siyempre, bahay ko na to. Nagbayad ako ng bill which is 250. The typical amount from Cubao to QC. Then suddenly, inabot niya ang kamay ko. Siyempre nagulat ko. Sabi ko, bakit kuya? Sabi niya sa akin na sunugin ko yung suot ko ngayon. Kanina pa ako nakatingin sa salamin. Wala kang ulo buong drive ko. I was really shocked and scared nung narinig ko yung kay kuya. Sabi pa ni kuya na, huwag kang matakot sir. Basta gawin mo lang sinasabi ko, walang mawawala kung susundin mo. As I reach home, I immediately opened a fire to burn all of my clothes that I wore that day. Then I prayed before going to sleep. That helped kasi nagising ako ng morning dahil sa phone call ni Justin. Asking me, are you okay? How are you kagabi? Di ka na nag-text ha? Sabi ko, I'm good. Nahihilo pa ako sa mojitos. Pwisit ka. I'm worried sa inyo kasi lasing kayo, Justin said. Huh? Kayo? Eh, mag-isa lang ako sa cab. I thought may hookup ka. I saw you guys sa cab eh. That's why I texted you. No, I'm effing alone, Justin. Weh, di nga. I saw a guy eh. Nakahawak pa nga sa shoulder mo. Then I shared to him what happened that night and he said, Guardian angel mo yun. Lakas mo kay Lord eh. We both laugh. Kayo ba? Do you believe in guardian angel? Guardian angels serve to protect whichever person God assigns them to ikanga. And this is my story.